First at 530, some honors classes for freshmen and sophomores in Barrington will no longer be on the table starting next year. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kim Kalunian. I'm Mike Montecalvo. As we first reported last night, the change is upsetting parents who are also criticizing the school district for a lack of communication as to why. Now, how honors classes factor into college admissions is a complicated science, but our 12 News reporter Anita Buffoni spoke with two colleges about how they consider students with honor courses under their belt. She joins us now from the newsroom with that story. Well, every college and university is different, but if a student that took honors courses is trying to get into a very selective school or program, they may have a slightly better chance of getting accepted. English and social studies honor classes at Barrington High School have been eliminated for ninth and 10th graders starting next year. Some parents say they want their child to be successful and honors courses help them on that path. But the school district says those changes are in part based on equity. The school district's website explains the change does not remove opportunity for those currently enrolled in honors courses. It increases opportunities for all students. Evidence shows that increasing access to honors level content can have the effect of raising achievement for all students, including higher performing students. Rigor of a student's curriculum is very predictive of their um, of their potential to be successful here on our campus. That's Amy Tiberio, Vice President for Enrollment Management at Roger Williams University. It's not uncommon you know, that we'll, we'll see schools that do not offer honors level or do not offer AP level. Um, but that, of course, you know, is something that would never penalize a student in the process. There are many factors that go into whether a student gets into a school. Honors classes can hold more weight in a student's GPA, but Amy explained if a student without honors courses had a rigorous curriculum, they may have the same shot of getting accepted. Now, Barrington school officials were not available for comment today, and a meeting to talk about these changes was scheduled for last night, but it needed to be rescheduled because a school official got COVID. That meeting has now been rescheduled for next Wednesday at 630. I'm Anita Buffoni, 12 News.